lift off. And the nation's first moon pilot is on his way to a rendezvous with destiny. But wait. Uh-oh. Gavin, what's going on up there? Yes, I am with you, it's my darling. Good heavens, General, that sounds like a woman. Impossible! I've got a lady here. You what? Well, sir, I've got something to do first before I go around our moon. What are you talking about? Say goodbye to the general, dear. Goodbye, General D. <laughs> When the nation's number one astronaut vanishes from the launching pad and steps out on the town with a gal from out of this world, it's the countdown for a rollicking romance on the run that panics the Pentagon and puts the police on the prowl from coast to coast. Washington was shocked. The senator wrote his congressman. Federal security even tried to investigate the FBI. Uh, don't give me platitudes. Just get me back my office, sir. Who is he? Why is he so important? Sorry, top security. General, I am security! But Tom Tryon, our moonstruck moon pilot, was absolutely dazzled by her supersonic charms every time she popped up from out of nowhere. Captain Talbot. Brian Keith was certain she was some kind of space-age kook. Edmund O'Brien thought she was an enemy spy. Search all of those joints. I want every female beatnik in the town brought in. All the sheep, I hate them, I hate them, I hate them. Cowards of conformity, protectors of the organization, and cowards. Away with the dollar bills that chain men to managers, and away with blue uniforms. What in heaven's name do you see in weirdos like that? And Danny Saval was the heavenly body that had them all flipping. Especially that certain space happy astro chimp. Uh, hello, General. This is Captain Talbot. Hey, Talbot. Talbot. Talbot! Oh, don't freeze this call. Talbot, are you listening to me? A big pardon, sir? It's from the dock area. I'm going after him. Keep him talking. Don't let him hang up. Brown, you got it pinpointed yet? You lost him! Just temporarily, that's all, sir. There was a bit of a mix-up, wasn't there? <laughs> but uh, we're hot on the scent, sir. <laughs> hot on the scent. I've got a lady here who's going to take me to her planet. And they've got seven moons, and they're all made for love. Love! Shut up, shut up, tell her, tell her. Don't you dare cut me off. Seven moons and balls. What's going on up there? Come on! Blast you, Tom, and I'll have you up for court martial. 